interesting young lady has joined us here this morning. Her name is Bryn uh, McLennan. How are you? Good. Good. How are you? I'm very good, thank you. Good. good. Nice to have you here. <laughs> nice I saw to be you here. in the building the other day, uh, but it's nice to have you back here on our show today. Thank you. Uh, you've got uh, uh, stem cells for Bryn is your website, right? Mm -hmm. Dot com. Um, you have uh, you have an interesting story. You have, amongst other things, fasciosscapulohumeral. Nice job. Thank you. <laughs> what happened to you? Uh, so I was diagnosed when I was 12 with uh, FSH, muscular dystrophy, and um, my mom started to notice the deterioration on my, of my muscles in my shoulder blade when I was swimming and noticed uh, a couple months later it moved to the other side. So uh, both my, my shoulder blades were winging out and uh, we went to Chio. Did you notice this yourself? When... I actually played competitive hockey. I know. And then uh, I noticed that I couldn't um, shoot as hard she was fast skate as hard. I was just, I was skating and skating and I was thinking, why can't I move quickly? Right. And it, there was no deterioration at the time. I just couldn't physically push my body. Right. And, uh, and then I got drafted. And then I, that year I couldn't play on the drafted Ottawa Capitals, unfortunately. Uh, boo. I know. Yeah, that, that sucks. Yeah. So then they found out you had this, uh, this FSH and mm -hmm. then you had muscular dystrophy, right? Yep. Um, and this, but you were, you knew you had muscular dystrophy at the time, or no? Just after I didn't know what was happening. Right? Yeah, and then I was diagnosed. So these two things came together. Is that rare? Yeah. Uh, no, it is a it is a, a type of muscular dystrophy. Yeah. Yeah. Now uh, we you got up here on the on the on the couch and everything, yeah. but you use a wheelchair most of the time. I use a wheelchair for long distances, or if I don't know what the terrain's going to be like, right. then I'll use it. Yeah. Right. But I, when I go to work, I walk. If I can walk, I try to walk. What do you do? I work for the Public Health Agency of Canada. Oh, do you? Yeah. Oh. And you have a your 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 spine is curved, right? Yeah. So how is it curved? Backwards. This way? Yeah. So when I stand, I would be this way. If back. if you stood up, you would be back here. Yeah. How far back? We have a picture, I think. Oh, very far. Wow. Yeah. That's incredible. And that's the thing. Sitting, people don't don't notice they don't anything. See it they don't see sitting. it. Yeah. And then when I'm standing, it's like shocking. Yeah. It is a bit shocking. Mm -hmm. yeah. And that's me when I was a little kid. And you were fine. F totally fine. Yeah. yeah. So you make it around okay? Like you, you know, you can. What can you do? I can drive. You I can live on my own. Have my own place. Do you? Yeah. Yep. So uh, just do things a little bit differently. Right, so uh, I can, yeah, and I love cars, love driving, and yeah. It's all good. So you've yeah. adjusted to. I have. Does yeah. it get any worse, Brent? Um, it's supposed to, but with the stem cell treatments, we've slowed it down, and with hopes we'll, we'll actually thing. reverse it. That's why you have this website, Stem Cells for Brent, and people can go on there and donate and find out more mm -hmm. about your story, right? Yeah. And by donating, they're helping you receive the treatments. Receive the which treatments. Are not cheap, right? Twenty thousand per treatment. Twenty grand. Yeah. Per treatment. Yes. How many treatments do you need? Uh, probably for the rest of my life. Like all the time? Yeah, two, three a year, yeah. And health care doesn't take care no. of all of that, right? No, because no. it's in the U.S. Oh, you have to go to the States have to, yeah. to get this. Mm -hmm. And how did you come up on the stem cell uh, uh, treatment? Is this new? It's actually my mom. She, my mom's like my doctor, right? She looks for all kinds of alternative stuff. and. We were going to spend the four minutes talking about how much you love your mom and yeah. how great she is, but we don't need to do that. Uh, she is fantastic. Thank you. And, uh, and I agree. She works hard for you, mm -hmm. right? Very hard. Yeah. So she came across the stem cell treatment, and uh, literally I'm up for trying anything, right? Might as well. What do I have to lose? So tried it, and I'm getting good results. Is that right? Yep. So what does this help with? It just slows down the process, or? Yeah, how I kind of think of it is outrunning it. Because it's not a cure, it's not going to eradicate it from my body, but I'm thinking that if we can just build up the muscle quickly, then yeah. we can outrun it and yeah. just keep me healthy. D is this rare, this uh, FSH? Yeah, it's, it's rare. Yeah? Yeah, it would be considered rare. Yeah, but you're doing okay. Doing okay. Listen, everybody, um, there's, uh, you blog on your website and you do all kinds oh, of yeah. things, right? So yeah. maybe you update your progress yep, and definitely. there's videos and for people to watch. It's a pretty cool story because you can watch Bryn and, and how she makes it through her everyday life when, you know, we just walk around, you know, as usual, and then you do you do your thing. So mm -hmm. I think that's pretty cool that people can experience that yep. with you. Yeah, right? and the hope would be to bring stem cells to Canada. It's not just for muscular dystrophy. Why can we not All have time? that here? Because we haven't started the... Um the scientific data of it and collecting and trying it on people or mice and all that stuff so it's not here yet you know i 
I, I'm not disappointed in, in what uh, we can do medically in this country because we've made great steps in, mm -hmm. in a lot of areas. Right. But we need to get this here so mm -hmm. we can look after you and people like you mm -hmm. uh, without having to travel to the States and pay 20 grand. Yeah, for treatment, exactly. Right. right. Make a donation while you're there and find out more about Bryn at uh, uh, stemcellswithbryn.com. Um, really enjoyed talking to you. Thanks, thanks so much. Thanks for coming by. Thanks for having me. Appreciate it. Come by anytime. Will do. And bring your mom. <laughs> She's okay. <laughs>